Okay, welcome back to my channel Mathematics, so this looks like a pretty easy problem, but many of you are going to get this wrong, and you'll probably be a little bit shocked, but don't panic, I'm going to fully explain you why you're probably going to get this wrong, and how to avoid this particular mistake. Well, let me go ahead and tell you the problem we have. We have 130 minus 20 divided by 2. Seems pretty basic, seems pretty easy, we have very simple subtraction, we have division, so everyone learned this stuff in the third grade, so that's fantastic. So go ahead and put your answer into the comment section, we have three options, choose one option what do you think is a correct and write your option down into the comment section, it will be really interesting to check our answers. So there are two types of people, first type of people solve this question randomly, solve this question like that, uh, they say ok, we have 130 minus 20 divided by 2, ok? Uh, let's subtract it first, right here we have 130 minus 20 equal to 110, we have this division by 2, so it looks like a correct answer is is 55. So first type of students solve this question like that. But I want you to know that in math we should know about order of operation, we can't solve this question randomly, we should know what is the correct order to do this problem. And for this let's look at this uh, PIMDMC. This is the most popular order of operation in the world, all internet libraries, scientific graphing calculator works according to PIMDMC, and let's solve this question according to PIMDMC. So we have 130 minus 20 divided by 2. Ok, right now let's solve this question according to this PIMDMC and let's check this 55, maybe 55 is a correct answer, I don't know exactly, but right now let's solve it according to a correct order, because we can't solve math question with two answers, yeah, it's really bad solution. So here's our challenge and let's scan what do we have, so uh, parentheses have the highest priority and the lowest priority addition and subtraction, so let's scan what do we have right here. We have subtraction, we have division, so let's, let's uh, put this sign, so right here we don't have parentheses, we don't have exponent, uh, we don't have multiplication sign, we have division, yeah, we, we find our first step, we have division, and we have subtraction, yeah, so we have only division and only subtraction, we don't have addition, so as you can see we have division and we have subtraction, but if you look closely, division is all the time before subtraction, so you should divide it first, then subtract or add, this is very interesting and important moment in terms of math. So we should divide it first, 20 divided by 2, we have like 130 minus 20 divided by 2 equal to, equal to 10. And finally our answer, 130 minus 10 equal to 120, and as you can see completely different answer as I told before. And what is the correct answer, 120 or 55? Of course, correct answer is 120. You ask me why? Of course, because we solve it according to a correct order of operation. In our case, this is PMDMC order of operation. This is absolutely wrong solution because we can't go with abstraction, then division. This is a very bad, bad uh, sign in terms of math because division is before subtraction, division is uh, before addition, division is before subtraction all the time. So multiplication and division group is all the time before addition and subtraction group. But with parentheses, this question will be good because you should. Uh, apply that you should solve this expression inside parentheses because parentheses is our first step and have the higher priority and then subtraction will be the first step 130 minus 20 will be our first step 110 and in our case correct answer is not 55 so we reject this step with parentheses this is 55 without parentheses this is not 55 in this case correct answer is 120 but let's look closely to the option 120 we don't have this option and sometimes students goes back to this wrong answer 55 they say okay a correct answer is 55 because we don't have this option 120 but what about this 5 factorial let's let's remember let's learn about this 5 factorial. This is equal to 1 times 2 times 3 times 4 times 5, this is a product, let's scan, what do we have? 1 times 2, 2, 2 times 3, 6, 6 times 4, 24, and 24 times 5, yeah, brilliant, 120, so 5 factorial, this is the same as 120. So as you can see, according to PMDMC, a correct answer is 120, according to this test, let's write it, so our answer our answer, correct answer is option, option C is a correct answer. Really interesting question, I hope you learned something new, I hope you understand that multiplication and division part is before addition and subtraction part all the time, and I hope you understand the correct order of operation. Definitely don't feel bad if you got this wrong, ok, now if you need to learn basic math, I have a lot of challenges on my channel, I have a lot of videos with these interesting questions every day, so if you're interested in this, you can really support me and subscribe to my channel, Mathematics channel, with really interesting questions, questions every day. So thank you for your time, I hope you enjoyed this video and wish you all the best, take care of yourself and hope you enjoyed this video.